When night falls, perceptions blur, illusions begin, and some take advantage of all three. Not magicians, but well-heeled entertainers with a sense of humor to boot. Some call them female impersonators. Channel 5's Tom Corvin joins us, and he calls them night people. Yes, indeed. This is a story about Charlie Brown, the cabaret, not the comic strip character. This is also a story about Ziggy Stardust, not the David Bowie persona, but a seven-footer in heels. But if anything, it's a story about night people with a preference for makeup and a place called Backstreet. She is the undisputed bitch of the South, Mr. Charlie Brown. Lena! La! Moshe! Give her yo! The fire goddess of Atlanta, Georgia! Rain. Good evening. Welcome to the fabulous Backstreet Metroplex and Charlie Brown's Cabaret Room. Enjoy the evening. My name is Charlie Brown. The cabaret for men are men, and the beautiful women are men. This is not in danger. This was my dog. Oh, let me get this on and get it over with. Expect the unexpected. We party. <laughs> Where we can take a flat chest and turn it into a treasure chest. Oh, that's Ziggy singing over there. <laughs> my stage name is Ziggy Stardust. My real name is Chester Phelps. I truly consider a, fem uh, a female impersonator uh, somebody who can be, uh, um, who, who can pass as a man and can give the illusion. We're walking in the park right now, but how do you normally like to spend your day? Sleep. In, pre in preparation for tonight. Asleep. No, <laughs> the makeup's a mask. I'm a different person whenever I'm in makeup. You have to go through a lot more than a normal guy would have to go through anyway. Or a normal <laughs> woman. It's an amazing transformation. Amazing transformation. It's like uh, an illusion of the eye. If you can uh, trick somebody for just that second. It's showtime. It's time to break to the stage. The tallest queen in captivity, Ziggy Stardust! I chose this career because I, I like to entertain people, but they all have this look on their face like, make me smile, make me smile, and that's what I, I, I try to do. It's fun, it's entertaining, it's what they do and what they do very well. Oh, this is very much family. My boss, and, you know, Charlie Brown, has probably done more than anybody can do for any, anyone. <laughs> Let the games begin. A lot of comedy here. Yeah, this sure is. That appeals to all sexuality. Yeah. Are you straight? Yes, we. <laughs> comedy. I want a comedy show. Hey, let me tell you something. If you can't laugh at a fat... 45-year-old, bald-headed man in dress. You have no business out after dark to begin with. The girls can actually come here and learn some stuff from these guys. Mr. Charlie Brown. Brave. Ziggy. Stardust. You can get that illusion for one moment, just for a moment. Then I've done my job. Are you having a good time? 11.30 p.m. to 5.30 a.m. Thursday through Sunday, Charlie Brown's Cabaret pulls out the pancake and comic punches. <laughs> now tomorrow at 5, performers of an artistic kind, coffee lovers who gather in a joint called the Liquid Bean. That's night people tomorrow pardon. night. I beg your pardon. Nah, that's all right. Don't yes. repeat it. <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow night. Yes, indeed. Can't wait. Thanks.